an RPG of the Ethereal Order. Cool. Character creation. Choose race and class. So you have human. Their bonus skill is attribute bonus. And they have those classes. Warrior, mage, cleric, necromancer. Orc with attack bonus. That sounds pretty good. High elf. Magic resistance. Night elf. Shadow elf. Sylvanus is a night elf. You got thief. Ah, the dwarves. Bash. Big old tanky torrents. Pulverize or spirit link. The trolls with the regeneration. Oh my god, there's a naga. There's a naga thief. <laughs> Centaur. Trample. And demon. Finger of pain. I think I'm gonna have to go and nag thief. It just seems too funny. So this is the warrior. This is the mage. Summoner. Summoner's pretty damn good. They get a lot of summons. Thief. Rap scallion. <laughs> Naga Rapscallion. I'm a Naga Thief. <laughs> oh, okay, so you start off as this, and then maybe over time <laughs> you upgrade into the uh, big one. Necros, the Naga Thief. Agility. We have Steel from an organic unit. A. 50% chance of success. I think I got something. I got 10 gold. Alright. So, uh, provides a permanent bonus to the hero's armor. So I get plus 5 armor. Which is pretty good at the start. Because everyone has zero armor. <laughs> so, 20% extra damage. Ooh. Oh, Woodstone. Why you do that to me? just keeps stealing from overclocked. Alright, so this is the starting position. Adventure points. None of us have any points at the moment. Here's the quest. In the beginning of the world, the gods and the titans made war. An ethereal order of warrior elite was assembled by a council of the gods. Tasked with defeating the titans and imprisoning them forever within the depths of the mountains. Ages have passed since the task was completed, but now the titans are again free and gather strength while amassing their great armies. Knowing this, the gods have summoned the strength of the ethereal order once again. Passing from the ethereal void, you arrive a shadow of your former self in the midst of the great earth. It is your task to restore peace to the land and destroy the evil that now corrupts it. Good luck, adventurer. Could go back to base and keep stealing. Get mana regeneration as well. Ooh, that's a big boy. Are we sure we want to take on a level 7? There's a lot to do there. Oh, I think it didn't work that time. Steel failed. 
Let us see if they'll let us in. These are the forces of good. And they grant us access. Got a quest. While walking down the western road on my way home from the Battle Dome, I overheard a gang of ogres plotting to destroy this village. They want some small amounts of riches. I'm afraid they're plenty of capable of taking it. These ogres don't stand a chance against a tough guy like you, so basically kill the ogres. What about items here? Sobe mask. Could be good. For that sweet regeneration. Much better for intelligence heroes, but... Fly to the battle dome. So he said battle dome, didn't he? Kill the ogre warlord. He might be a bit strong though. Ogre warlord. Hi there, if you're looking for some adventures, try visiting this website. Over here. Well, you can just buy cheap. Um, this is good for mana. I'll just buy those. Oh, you get loads of charges. So potions are probably a really good bet at the start. <laughs> Gotta try. And there's more expensive potions here. Hello. No one spotted that. You guys blind? You don't read? So you can't see where your allies went, which is interesting. Unless we're all in this one spot, which may be the case, actually. So yeah, maybe you can't see. Should we teleport to the Ogre Dome or just keep exploring? What a good companion, just casually steals every 20 seconds from you. Yeah, don't tell him what the plus 10 means. Oh, the bandit lord. Yeah, we were fighting him. So, yeah, let's go continue that fight then. Try to get level 2 then from the creeps and then go take the bandit lord. Oh, he got an. In <gasps> wow! Old school. Overclocked, you need that time of agility. <laughs> I can't steal it. It's the old school where you used to actually get it in your inventory and you had to click it to use it. Looks like you get gold on last hits, so people are going to be like, try harder for that. Oh, too busy stealing. Oh, nice, he's got healing wards. Overclock can generously put those down to help us out at the next spot. I see you are satisfied. Oh, you are not satisfied. It is good that you see me. I can give you a new body, but a price of half your current experience. No, I quite like the Naga Thief. No. Yeah, maybe we can't do this. I don't know. Unless we can get enough range to keep exploiting it. Then it's doable. But the melee aren't very useful here.
yoink. Although it's not particularly exciting. But it does sell for 400 gold, actually. Plus 8 armor. And then I can also get evasion. Might want to get wind wart there just for now. Faster movement speed. Oh, you can steal from critters, but it's just zero. So uh, that's unfortunate. Wait, did we speak to the guy after killing the bandit lord? It was this guy. Return to the mayor. This isn't necessarily the mayor, is it? Thank you for your assistance, but I have no further requests. Okay. Oh, I got twenty. Haze is rich. Oh, the cooldown's increased, isn't it? Or no, it was 24 seconds before, I think. <laughs> Probably be best to... Have you heard the tale of Darth Plagueis the Meow? He was such a wonderful cat. I heard him meow and bring people back to life. It was amazing. Sounds like a cool cat. <laughs> Thanks, Desire. An invisible hero is untargetable by the enemy. Yeah. I'm gonna level up my Naga Thief by stealing as much as possible. Those boots are like 300 gold. So he's got. Wind walk allows me to catch up for a steal. <laughs> it's inevitable. <laughs> Cheeky Naga thief. Yeah, all I need to do is get like a mana pendant that artificially increase my my mana. And then drop them, use the potion of mana and keep rinse and repeat them. But it's pretty cheap. Steel is only thirty. have a mission that we're attending here or are we just randomly walking around? <laughs> we need to go deal with the pack of gnolls.
Can I even steal from somewhere? They got like no money left. Whoa. I don't know. We want this. Where was the ogres? To steal or wind walk? That is the question. I guess I have to wind walk. <laughs> Got the plus two hundred uh Yeah, I think you're supposed to use steel on enemies. <laughs> Overclocks, you want this time of strength. No wait, you're we don't have a strength hero, do we? Two, four, five. We missing one. Well, maybe not. Alright, well, time of strength then. Don't really have the mana for Shadow Strike, so just take evasion. Boost of speed, always good. Don't know if I want the armor anymore. I don't know, I'll just keep it. It's not too bad. This regenerates mana over time. That's definitely pretty good. But the mana potion's better. Because it's pretty much the same amount. Except a lot cheaper and not over time. I wonder why they keep attacking me. Maybe just go s s tomes. You can access different casters, but we're a thief, so we don't need anything else other than just. Tomes and inventory spots for items. I'll greedily take that for now. There was a greed coin, wasn't there? Oh man, I didn't spot it. We're gonna have to work out what the heck it is we're doing. Like, have we got a plan? Have we got a plan here? There's a ship, costs 600. Picking up so many quests, but not really paying attention to what they are. Sea giants. I mean, you can just go around picking up all the quests and then... Killing something is inevitably going to... Well, 120 from that one. This foe is too strong. I'll keep him busy. Who cast that lightning shield?
You moved in quick there. Trying to even it out a little bit and steal from everyone. Make it fair. <laughs> Maybe go over there. <laughs> it's just 10. Just in time for my cooldown. We're going to be rich, boys. Oh, time of knowledge. Inventory is full. Why are we going? Was the ogres this way or? That's Fobelgs. Oh. Ah, he is some ogres. So maybe if we go inside the cave, it might take us to the leader. Damn, Scourge Brain Chimes. There's a lot of bloody items here. Go back and sell some. Mm. Yeah. All I need is the cheap uh, mana potions. On this item. And we're good. Can I steal from city guards? If they're invulnerable, I can't steal from them. I don't know if they're invulnerable, though. <laughs> I'm just waiting to steal. Success. You'll most likely just get rich if you pick up a good item anyway. But I can get rich just from stealing, so I'll let the others get the items for the most part. Unless it's something like super agility or whatnot. Failed on the Ogre Lord. Ooh, cause of attack plus 15 is not bad. But I'll save it.
Oh my god. Did you just TK me? That really looked like he was facing me. I hope I get those points. This will suck if I'm like still level 4. He did TK, didn't they? It definitely looked like he looked towards me and swung his weapon. Because I I'm normally quite good at calculating it, so that I sort of just about narrowly stay alive. I'll be back. Oh, I'm level six. You screwed me over. Literally screw me over at two levels. Jesus. Right, I'm gonna steal exclusive exclusively from Overclock now. Unless I can't reach anyone else in time, but I'm gonna go out of my way to make sure I steal. I ruined the 1337 guard. One of those few times I didn't notice I had that. I've got to go buy some more tones. I'm just going to buy tones, basically. Even though there might be some super expensive item. Still failed. Yeah, Mexican Airlines level 5 as well. Yeah. You had the intelligence time, I don't need that. Of course, Overclock's got bloody taking. That was stupid. Just keep looking around for those gold coins. You know they're gonna be there. He like a star for teleportation. Well, at least I got those points. Yeah, the wind walk's very helpful for getting around the map. Do what you gotta do. I'm just a lonely naga. Doing what he can to survive in this world full of humans, elves, and dwarves. Scrimp and save. Time and knowledge. We'll just go full agility. Oh, it's on cooldown now. So that's not so good. Gonna have to remember to do that then. Eh, you may as well get those then as well. I got space for it. That's how it's done. What's our next mission? It's quite nice to have a RPG map to play again. Could pick those up and sell them for money, but yeah. It's not enough money, I don't think. Buy Mercs.
Weird. You can get a castle and stuff. Just like one shot him. Some nice boost of speed there for someone if they want him. They'll sell for 150 gold at least. Shoot, someone hasn't got the boots yet. I'm starting to attack pretty damn quickly now. Even mana burn, so I don't want to take the mana just yet. Oh, Kegger's pipe. There you go, Mexican. You're saved. I'll just take this trash for now because it will heal me up nicely. Looks like I picked the right character then, doesn't it? <laughs> Is badass. I bet the cooldown on that's relatively uh, recent again. If I can get to like fifteen hundred gold again or something, go and revisit that. I think. Thief's Dagger. That's mine. I'll go for it because I got the heal in a second. Careful, Mexico. Yeah, you get wind, wind walk as well. If there's any YouTubers watching this video at this point in time, make sure to thumbs up the video now. Defiled fountain. So that's got to be a quest to clean up the fountain. So these are the quests we've done so far. We've got the lighthouse, return the flame, return a sample of rock, and the remains of a fallen champion, but we haven't actually got a quest for anything that mentions Defiled Fountain, so I don't know if we want to necessarily do this yet. Unless I've missed it and didn't speak to one of the NPCs. So I don't know if it goes to all of us or not. the chance of getting um what's it called wow yeah times <laughs> i mean there's the boat that you can buy as well for 600 gold i remember that i'm just not exactly sure maybe we should be able to ping that would be i mean advice to any map creators out there 
if you had like a command for a quest, like Margo, for example, you just type in dash Margo and it will give you like a ping as to where you're supposed to go. Obviously that's some of the adventures to try to find it, but at other times it's nice to have like a, an idea as to what it is you should be doing. This is a big boy. Does he drop a corpse or something for us to use? Must have got some gold from him. Could keep him alive and just keep stealing from him every 20 seconds. <laughs> oh! <laughs> he didn't like that. He did not like that. He was not a fan of being stolen from... <laughs> Actually, uh, sell for that much, but it's plus five, plus five, which isn't bad. Still success, still success. I assume that the success didn't actually go off properly, unless I did get the gold. Only you guys watching the FUD will know for sure whether I got like double there because he went around the corner and then it thought that the spell didn't go off, but technically the trigger procked for me to get the gold anyway. I don't know. Then I don't know that. Oh, she's... She's come out! The crown of King Thot! He dropped two items. Although Seraphil's pretty fucking damn good. Probably the better one, actually. Alright, time to go back down to here and pick up some times. Increase the attack rate by 15% and attack damage by 15. Also gives a larger life bonus. So unfortunately it doesn't give you like crit or cleave, which is what I thought I might get. But we'll definitely hold on to that. We got Vampiric from this. So there's the three main items. Oh, there's another point of steel. Six second cooldown, what the fuck? <laughs> I better go find Overclocked and torment him. What's he doing all the way over there anyway? Dicking around on his own adventure. Right. My work here is done. It's 120 for stealing there. Well, you shouldn't have TK'd me then. Oh my god. I could just sit here farming. <laughs> 120 gold is basically one time. Need, we need more places that sell terms, and then I can bounce back and forth between them. Obviously, killing will give you some gold as well. Yeah, Overclock must have a pretty thick purse at this point, because I haven't stolen from it in a while. So there's plenty of money there, I reckon. So it probably takes, what? Uh, it's 113 seconds or something. So I'd just say 120, 240, 360. So you're looking at what was it, 11 minutes or something like that? For all three tomes of all three types to regenerate. Right, let's have a look at one of these quests in the lighthouse. The Elf Lieutenant has asked you to recover the flame of Rumiel from the furbogs that are located across the river, northwest of the Elven Village. The flame is of source of light, so northwest of the Elven Village. So you got this village, and you got this village. This looks elvish, right? Because of those buildings. So northwest is over here. Oh, I see. So yeah, you're doing that now. 
That's a big chunker right there. For Bola. Yeah. Vamp potion. It's not a bad idea, Dragon Dennis. We don't need it at the moment, though. I'm just still exploiting. This chunk is given 170 gold. Oh, Mask of Death. Holy shit. No. Oh. Inventory is full. Yeah, I know, because I'm trying to drop an item for it. Wow. 50% life steal on an agility hero that's stacking up tomes. That seems kind of... These items are kind of really OP, actually, at this stage. There's the item. But not for, like, a, you know... What's it called? Not what you would think, actually. You thought it'd be from a lighthouse or something. I'm coming over here to hand it in because I assume it's in the elf village, the quest. But it might have not been. It might have actually been here because it mentions the elf village. So if it was here, why would they say the elf village? Unless that was just... What the hell? Who gave me the quest? Thank you for your assistance. So it's not this guy. Down there. Welcome, adventure to the seaport of the elves. You've returned the flame. Oh, right, there we go. We did it. Ding. Rapscallion calls forth the diminutive imp, Rapscallion, whom the thief keeps hidden away in his pocket. Rapscallion will serve the thief for 60 seconds. I wonder if he can steal. Man, what the hell is this? What is this? He didn't steal on nothing. I was thinking it was going to have like steel so I could double steel. Okay, what's our next quest then? That was one of the later quests. Overclock's gone all over the place and probably picked up quests that we shouldn't even have at this point. So let's stick to what we picked up in the first place, which is one of these two, I think. I know this one was, so it must be retrieved. Elven, so it's to the priest and the elven before the Nacro magician. They lie somewhere in the northeastern part of the swamp. Where's the swamp? I mean, that looks pretty evil, but I wouldn't call that a swamp necessarily. And up here looks barren. So you think the swamp is over here. <laughs> I could just send Rapscallion to go around attacking things. Crown of the Death Lord. Crown of Kings. Oh, yeah, you're stacking up Crown of Kings as well, yeah. So the what, northeastern part of the swamps. Let's go to the swamps then. Let's aim for light here. I assume this is the swamp. Darn well looks like one. This character is so OP already. Yeah, the summon does hit hard. He doesn't attack move very well though, because he's like invisible all the time, I think. So I've got to sort of manually make him attack. So he's kind of like a bit of a chore. Oh no, he is attacking there. 
I've actually run out of mana, shockingly enough. Oh, mana stone. Can we stack those? Northeast and past, so let's keep heading northeast. Oh, there's another level on Thief. What? That has no cooldown! What the do? 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 So I just need pure intelligence. What the hell? <laughs> Why? Why? What was he thinking? Oh, let's go try to do this quest. Wait, Overclock got it. Where is Overclocked anyway? I don't know. It failed a bunch of times when I tried to do it. Maybe I can get gold. I don't know if it actually takes gold out of your account or just sort of like takes gold. Yeah, where is Overclock? Ah, oh, it's over here. It's time to get mana. Lots and lots of mana. I need like the fastest mana regeneration in existence. So he's going to a village. Looks like he's coming over to Elven Village. So if I go to the Elven Village. Oh, I've got to wait for the Elven. What? No! I've got to wait for this thing to return. I can't even, like... can steal from my buddy. I think it fails a bunch of times though, because they probably don't have money for you to steal. Am I like permanently stuck? Okay. I was going to use the info potion. I went, oh wow. Okay. Here we go. Flappy birds. This is cool. I see you. Well, I'm getting money from it. <laughs> we still haven't true. Oh, we haven't truly established yet. I can just. So if I just keep doing this, so you're not actually losing money. Oh, this is so broke. I'm using stop and T to do it quicker. To cancel the animation of the spell. How do I always manage to break maps? I've said this before, but I'd be like one of the best quality assurance testers in the existence of mankind. Why would you put no cooldown on this thing? 
Shame there's like nothing to buy though. <laughs> oh, my fingers are tired. There's a tiny castle, what, millions of tiny castles. balanced naga thieves so this is why nagas aren't playable in melee games because they're too op i like how he kind of goes like pure yellow as if he's wearing some weird lycra suit or something be back. I'm going to go put it over here because this is closer to an area that we haven't ex explored yet. I haven't even been in this one yet. So the map makers put quite a lot of effort into this, but it feels a little disjointed, I'm not going to lie. Oh, it's massive and the road takes up so much space. He keeps putting unbuildable terrain. Wait, why are you attacking my back? <laughs> I can replenish health and mana. So I could just stand here next to someone. It doesn't do much else though. And G and T in this case. G, I changed this move to G. So they're basically moon wells. By moving at them, I'm not attacking them. Now I can attack it. I've got nothing else. My stuff is still there. Wherever it was I went the first time. Somewhere along here, but then I don't know that. I don't know if we actually did that defiled fountain area. Like, finished it off or not, or just left it. I, I know I left it. I don't know where it is. Where's the lady? It's near the defiled fountain. Our town is under siege. I'll go down, then I'll go right, and then I'll go up. Ah. So, yeah, it's just southeast of the defiled fountain. Overclock didn't hand in Margafron's remains, though, did he? I can't build there. I can't build there. 
Get the boat, sure. We'll go down and try the boat. Tiny Almar. Oh they do not like this. Oh, they did nick my items. <laughs> of course they did. I thought he said the castle was supposed to be like able to attack or something. The, fa the house just holds items. Which I guess is okay. So the difference here is... It does actually attack. So it can farm. Although I've lost one of these already, unless it was team killed by a 389. I'll go back down to the bottom. Overclocked is messing around over here. Problem is we're too strong compared to a lot of the creeps. So the balance is a bit off. There's definitely a really good amount of effort put into this map. But it feels like it would be better if it was um, less open, I think. And more streamlined, where it makes you focus on doing like one or two quests at a time. So it keeps you sort of like in the same vicinity, if that makes sense. Because if you look at the map, we've just like blasted all over it. That's my opinion, though. Right, I'm in a boat. And here's an island. I assume... Oh, yes. There we go. Quest for these. Keep trying to steal. He's about to cast a storm bolt there. I was going to try to avoid it point blank, but must have done it too early. So there's the shadow key. Look at that life steal. <laughs> and then we got evasion as well. Got him. Where's the gold? It's not an amazing item. It's not a quest item either, is it? Oh, a little dungeon bit. Looks like someone's been here before, though. Some of it's explored. Oh, I think that was the eagle exploring it, actually. So, yeah, I was going to say, because I don't think anyone actually has come this way. Alright, we'll leave this rolling stone door for last. Because I assume that's where the big boy is. And we'll just explore the rest of it. They're still quite chunky, even with all my stats. Murloc is badass. Success. Oh, yeah, it's a Naga. True. Actually, it's a Murgul. If you was going off the model, but... Adventure. Oh, wait. My health's not barely even dropping.
Oh, well, some battle drums, maybe. It's two less damage at the moment. Oh, my gold. The Kraken. This will be tough because of the storm bolts. So I'm going to have to kite, kite them out and kill them. Sort of like drag them. Maybe another storm bolt. They don't have unlimited mana though. I'll keep this one alive. We've got a good blockade here. Using up your precious storm bolts. You're out of juice. <laughs> it's time. Can't stop the Murloc. Can't stop the Naga. Oh, I'm not another ring of protection. I got so many of those. It does sell for better than the Warsung Battle Drums, but I don't need money, do I really? He says as he picks up like 10 gold, 25 gold. I'm not going back for that. I die. That's how much I don't need the money. Actually, it does bother me though, leaving that there. Take these since I'm here. Scepter of the Sea. Oh, that must be a quest item. Cool. I will go back. That big boy might be there again. Wow, he is. That will do. Because we can go buy the times again now, probably. Who wanted this? Oh, is... Is it not a quest item? Dwarven Mountain King promises to make Dragonhide armor. Slay the dragon. In the volcanic mount. Southeast of the Dwarven City. Dwarven City must be this one over here, maybe. Access to the Goblin Observatory built on the Western Baron's Mountain is restricted due to the presence of a great dragon guard in the pass. A goblin is asked that you get the much needed supplies past the dragon. Don't know that one so well. Transport the goblin supplies. I don't even have the goblin supplies. So someone might just drop that item. The guardian ghost has asked you to task. What's going on here? By destroying. Oh, I see. Destroying the evil Shadow King. I thought Overclock did that one. The Shadow Key was found. It just hasn't been. He's got to destroy it unless it's given him stats or something. That's the only reason why he hasn't destroyed it. Or he's got to take it to a fountain or something. And we still got this one.
I get gold for winning gold! <laughs> There's got to be tomes to buy from this place. I haven't checked. Oh! I don't think this is the quest time, so I'm just going to sell it. Actually, I won't even sell it. No, get off me. I'm going to just buy these. Very expensive things. Hey, adventure points. Points for adventure. What's this bit up here? Oh, this is just the observation part. This little kid is watching people fight like this. It's terrible. Oh, shite. I don't know where this is going! <laughs> I don't know this area. I gotta speak to that goblin settler. Where's the info potion? There we go. See you later, boys! <laughs> <laughs> Off on a whimsical <laughs> adventure. Fly to human village. Alright. Here we are at the human village. Oh, so long ago where we once here. I'm going to check out this section of the map that looks like it hasn't been fully explored yet. Some cheeky satyrs. Sobe mask for that precious mana regen. Actually, mass Sobe masks would be, actually be pretty good. What to drop though? Is it, is it still better than that? That's a quest item. Or is it? I don't even think that's a quest item necessarily. I just think it's a special item, quotation marks. But it's not great. So, just get the adventure points from it. And like the Scepter of the Sea, I think it's just a special thing. You bought the boat, you get like a little reward for doing it. Looks like there'd be a boss type character up here. I'm knackered because of that subathon. Knackered! It's just gold. Let's come over here. No, I don't have four more gold. Such a good character, this one. What's up here? I assume you killed a boss up here. Imagine being so greedy that you could actually have freaking steel on like no cooldown. Nifog. Nidhog. I can't attack him though because I need some anti air. Which is a shame. I don't. I think there was an orb or something in one of these places. Maybe over here. Or is it here? Oh, I didn't even go to this place. What's that village called? It's probably this little area here. The 
Let's come over here and get an orb then. I think I could drop a crown of kings for just one Sobi mask. Bizarrely enough. Because like 100 intelligence is so much. And you get bonus mana regeneration based off your intelligence. I wouldn't want to get rid of any of those ones. These are all great. I mean, technically, I don't really need that. It's a lot of money, and, you know, it's 15% attack speed and damage. Otherwise, life bonus It's not super amazing. It's just 15% attack speed and damage, basically. That's all I see from that item. So, if anything, that item isn't that good after all. I don't care the orb stack with mask or not. I just need to be able to attack the bad boy. Orb of Corruption is best orb. Even Orb of Frost is super good, but Orb of Corruption lets me kill things quicker. And it sounds funny. Actually, Orb of Frost, to be fair. Because uh, if I do PvP first, it's overclocked. He can't run away so easily. Did he bet money then to duel me? And he just assumed he was going to beat me. Yeah, yeah, I'll drop the Mask of Death when I fight the dragon. Calm down. I mean, we'll find out if I'm applying Frost here. And now that's lifesteal. Please don't splash damage that mask. I like that mask. I can't steal it because it needs to be a ground unit. This guy's actually beating me. Wait. I can still attack him and then do that. Oh, he's still kicking my ass. Oh my god, he's strong. The one opponent that I actually can't just roll over. Oh my god. That's oh, a double mask of death. It's... How many of these things are lying around? You gotta come back. Can't fly away forever. Or can he? I get two wraps coming. No, don't run away. I almost, I almost got you. Oh, maybe that's what he does. You don't actually kill him. He just drops the item and runs... Oh, no, no. Never mind. Where's he going? Dragons and chat. Forging of the sword. 
Elven Smith. Wait, no, that's just something else. I'm getting the armor at the moment. At least I think I am. Dwarven Mountain King. So I'm just assuming these guys are the dwarves. Because it ain't those, it ain't these. I can't get the ore. Can you not notice there's six here? And I assume you need all six to craft the item. There's a dwarf. There you go, see? Oh, frickin' hell. <laughs> Yeet! Could sell a couple of those. <laughs> Hang on. And go back for the other items. Don't need that much armor. Let me in. It's a bit much though, isn't it? I don't need that much armor. Do I sell one more? I had the mask and I had the boots. I don't know if there's really anything else that much I need. Just need the mask. Really. So get back to there. Then I gotta to fly to the battle dome. Sixty-nine percent. Oh, there's the ore. Yeah. Me and my yellow jumpsuit. I need the mask. Yeah, now we've got the sword, actually. The Elven Village is down here. I'm going to take the cinematic view, though. What about here? How do you get to here? I think you can only fly to the Battle Dome, actually. It looks like one of those places you can only fly to, because there was that high ground and you couldn't even go anywhere else. Has Grubby still not come back to Warcraft 3? Right? I thought on one of these streams he said uh, Age of Empires 4, then Warcraft 3. Right? How many people are left in the game? <laughs> oh! I didn't realize three of them left. I felt like one might have left at this point. Bunch of slackers. Not getting the most out of it. Right, where are we going? Battle Dome? To buy the tomes, maybe? Or, yeah, let's go Battle Dome after I've gone to the Elven Village and... Whee! Well, this is the evil... evil few. I actually did one versus one melee earlier, because the four versus four RT is so, uh... so trash. There's a gold coin there. Then I don't know that. There's the sword. Hound of the gods. Finger of death. Immolation. Sniff. So there's four titans, is there? Now we're talking. The Hound of the gods has spoken. I 
Am I level capped? I think I'm level capped. I'm gonna go to the battle dome. I must explore there first. I've been there. If that's the place I think it is. How do you get there otherwise then? I thought it was literally you could only get there by flying there. Oh, never mind. It just wouldn't do it because I was windwalked. This is an RPG. You've played RPGs before, haven't you, commun communist? Where's overclocked? Time to do battle. So buying this would do nothing, because I'm capped. It would just actually give him... There's a duel in progress. There's only overclocked some evil. Who the hell's evil dueling? I guess you can't duel. Duels are off. With pleasure. It's got plus 136 damage. Ninety-one seconds. I'll see you later. Take those. Don't want to lose too much armor. point trying to deal if you ain't alive. It says there's a duel in progress. It's very good. Showing off. <laughs> he just TP's out. You trapped yourself. <laughs> What's the cooldown on that town portal? It's in your spell book, isn't it? We need to get in the dome. There's a key there to get to the Titan. Well, duels ain't working, so that's the problem, isn't it? Someone broke them.
Blink might do it. Unless you can summon a unit inside of there and then just have 389 Town Portal into it. My guy's working out how to get over to that place I right clicked. My castles are doing great. My homes. My expensive homes. Yeah, I mean, you can get some spell books. So you can possibly find a spell book that's going to answer. See, here's one of the titans. I need that bloody orb again, don't I? Ugh. i got to travel all the way to get an orb. Just so I can attack air. Uh, I left it over here. Good thing I got a wind walk, innit? I really did have, like, the best... Uh, Best hero in the way. For getting around on this map. Don't mind me. Right, let's get rid of one of those. Get that orb. There's the boost of speed. I guess I really want those at this point. But like we don't need all that armor. So now I ended up having none of the dragon shields. <laughs> With all these other items. Because I just favor this stuff instead. Like I got crit with this. This is almost the same amount of armor. But actually 10% bonus damage. Yeah, you're doing very helpful work there. Probably capped whilst wind walking, you think? I don't know. I feel like he's moving quicker. Uh, maybe not, actually. Yeah, maybe not. Oh well, we'll see what this guy drops. Little rap scallions. Drops nothing, which means that he must have been killed before, right? So he's just farm status at this point. So that's one of the titans that's already been killed. I think I saw Overclocked over here a while ago, so he probably killed whatever Titan was there. And then there's two Titans in this area that we haven't seen yet. You'd think there would be like um, a quest to kill all the Titans, wouldn't you? You're going to have to get creative. Scallions to keep him busy. Why does everyone have freaking stun? There's a gauntlet. Thunder gauntlet. So he hadn't been killed. Just a quest item there. it up just to see if it does anything. Inventory is full. I'm going back to the Elvish village to take a look at those spell books. 
Oh, someone worked hard on this map. Like I say, that's pretty good. There is a feeling of emptiness about it, though, which is a shame, because it looks pretty polished otherwise. I don't think it forces you to do enough things as a group. And that's where it loses some of the uh, the connectivity. <laughs> Broxilla. I could try that again at some point, Styler. What made you think about that? I completely forgot about that existing. I like the way Snaraz thinks. Evening. Evening. Thank you very much for the sub. Right, let's take a look at these spell books. There's the Warlock one. Firebolt, Bloodlust. Bloodlust would be quite good, wouldn't it? And Lightning Shield. That ain't gonna do it. So put that well put that to here. Druid, Druid, Druid. That's no good. Sorcerer, Blizzard, Fort Line of Invisibility. Interesting. No good. Rejuve, Inner Fire. And it was Sleep, wasn't it? Or was it Dispel? Abolish. No, Sleep. You could probably just chain Sleep someone to be annoying. Death Coil, Banish, Raise Dead. Spell steal, dispel magic, control magic. Uh, so that is unfortunate. There really isn't anything that. That could be classed as like exploitable, I think. I think you're going to have to block that. Yeah, that's too hard to get in there. Maybe if you did it from the corner, but even then, I don't think it would teleport you to the low ground. So is there really no way? Like, we haven't even tried to explore down here. These more houses. Oh, my God. I'm going on a house journey here. Is there an option to zoom out? So, after selecting your hero, you may toggle between two different camera modes by using the S key. Standard and follow. So that's zoomed out. And you can rotate the camera. Can you TP to a raised dead? Yeah. You could. There's the scepter as well. I can't remember where I dropped the scepter, but that summons murlocs. If you positioned yourself, you might be able to summon the murlocs in a way. I don't think you can ever summon to lower ground, though. Maybe you can. Oh, hello. That's the only problem with a, <laughs> a camera angle like that. Oh, I might have sold the staff. I don't know if I did, actually. I might have still dropped it. But just sort of near that dude. But yeah, I might have sold it. It's possible. Normally, I wouldn't let myself do something like that in case it was needed for something. But Oh, I dropped it in the arena. Oh, my God. Yeah, because I had to. I think I was going to lose the fight, maybe, if I didn't get the fan. Right, this is another Titan, Ymir. I actually can't steal from Ymir. Hello, my name is Ymir. Would you like to buy a necklace? 
It is authentic necklace. Five dollar. Ymir is quite a badass. Why Russian accent? Ymir is Scandinavian mythology. I don't think I can do Scandinavian accents. I don't really try. Get them, boys. Scroll of Animate Dead. Wait, can't we summon something? You can buy mercs, can't you? Let's get the Scroll of Animate Dead. Frost Guard. Adventure. Oh, wait. Probably better than uh, ever so slightly. Just the tiniest bit better. Yeah, than all the frost. So that's the other Titan. There's one other over here. There's a gate here. You guys still trying to get in there? What's that spell book thing that you got? Drek for Ah, oh, you can only get one of those. So where's the mercs? If you built a house like there, yeah, are you going to do that? Oh, you're not going to build a house there? It will plonk you. Wait, 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 wait. No space. Ah, oh, that sucks. What about over here? It'll just port you over here, I think. Yeah, that corner spot is like the most important spot. Shadow key. Ah, oh, why would you? D yeah, you dropped like the most important item. This is overclock's fault. The shadow key. He literally said earlier, like, the Shadow Key is like the last quest. So desperate to win against me. But you should know that winning against me is basically impossible. There was another scroll of thingamajig, actually. Let's just sell that. Or drop that. Scroll, uh, scroll of res... Doesn't work on. Yeah, yeah. You can't even get the jewels to work, so. We're having to try to fix your problem here. Which is coincidentally all of our problems. Overclocked is just a problem in general. Right. Let's check out the mercs. So, I don't think this guy can go shopping, can he? That'd be cool if he could. Wasn't there a dude that can do the horse? That was the... Can I fly in my Hound of the Gods? There was mercs up northwest. I know that much. We haven't done the other quest. The other quest might give a blink item or something for all we know. I like how these are little bases and the doors open for you. Go to the human village. Ah, oh, doesn't count on this creature. It seems to be like perma -impis.
No, I've not seen that, Sith Lord. What is it? We're, we're on the verge of banning Overclocked a lot recently. I, I do need to see some Age of Empire build strategy videos, maybe. Like, legit, the best of the best. If you're going to watch one, you may as well watch the best of the best. There's the horse. There he is. Oh, good, he's not terribly slow. So if we have a horse at, like, each of the Merc places, then we can sort of test Mercs. So there's a village over here. Try to get one horse there. There's something over here. And there's that over there. And this over here. Or, there was a... There's some sort... I know it was on the left-hand side here. There it is. Well, don't kill my horses. It's not going to be much good if they get... Why have they got 350 health? Those, like, any time, any map that has horses, pack horses, in it, it's always freaking scuffed. Under sure are. There's only one Titan left, actually, so maybe they don't respawn. Or if they do respawn, then it just remembers which ones you killed. Skeletal Annihilation, Pro Map, Speedrun. Let's go. I'm really surprised OP doesn't like work more on Baron's TD or make more maps like Baron's TD. That was really good, that map. But he's sort of like adamant on like permanently working on Lumber TD. He's done like 50,000 iterations of Lumber TD. Right, so we bought that. I don't know if there's mercs here. Don't think there's anything that way. This portal doesn't do anything. Do we activate this portal? Because something looks like it's here. Oh, that was the lighthouse. I see. Ah, oh, that's funky. Put this here. That's a projectile in the placement of the head of that building. I don't think you can buy mercs from here. So, some of my horses made it, I think. That's one. That's not... What happened to the horse here? You better not have killed it for it, man. Because that's really not helping if you did. And the other horse, I have no idea where the hell it went. So, I've, as far as I know, I've only got one horse that survived. So, you got Flesh Eater... Sludge Flinger, the Wolf's got it, Soul Stealer. He can raise dead, actually, the Soul Stealer. Trial Berserker, Priest, Sleep, Triumph. So not really much to work with there, to be honest. I don't think you can get those Mercs over to the Battle Dome anyway, to be frank with you. Even in the best case scenario, I don't think you can do it. I see, that's a Merc. Oh. Troll Trapper, Priest, Trickster, Purge, Curse, Auto Attack, Heal. I do have a horse here. It's not horse desire, it's a horsey. Giant chieftains. The big lads. Big boys. Look at the dead! There you go! There it is, boys! There it is.
Book of Dead. We've done it. We got it. Save the day. To be fair, I'm still not even 100% sure this is going to work. You got a pig? That's good. Really depends how 389 uses the item. Could I have, like, the spell book or something? Let's put the character over here or something. Wherever that Book of the Dead was, that was useful. Oh, there is a flying unit. But you can't really TP to that. Where's a pig? Gyrocot is chasing me. We can only portal to our house. Man, what the fuck, they? Need an inventory. Can I help you? Our forces are under attack. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. Oh, I thought that worked for a second. Yeah, I need teleports to houses. Which means that we really are screwed then. I'm going to buy that blink dagger. Nah, it's not a blink dagger. You, you never know. Remake. I guess we can't remake it. It's too much time has gone at this point. We can just blame overclocks. Any flyers with inventory space? There's two flyers as far as I know and neither of them have inventory space. Could you share units, 389? So I can sort of see how that hero works. Our forces are under attack. So you click on this and you just teleport to site. You got Rage Skeleton, Poison Cloud, Dark Ritual Infect. Oh, you idiot. I think I know how to do this. To command. Well, maybe, maybe not. I can do that at least, but I can't necessarily get you over there anyway, because you can't teleport to that. And he doesn't have an inventory, unfortunately. Feels bad, man. Destroy the key. Yeah, I mean, shit. <laughs> I didn't think that was going to teleport as well. So it teleports everything. Hmm. What about Horsh? If you could somehow block yourself in, and then it would 
maybe get one of the units down and maybe that unit could be a horse. Can you build a house through the gate? What do you mean? Through the gate? You can't TP down or up cliffs. No, I don't think you can, but... At least we know that infect works. So you can do that again. And we can technically destroy the Shadow Key. It didn't say we had to destroy it in a special way, did we? Find. Ah, oh, unfortunately the quest text disappears. So if maybe you just destroy it, but more likely you need to blow it up or put it somewhere. You'd think it would go like here or something, but I don't see anywhere where it needs to go. Like, I haven't really checked the top right. Is there any... F Overclock, did you spot anything that looked like you would put the shadow key there? Shadow King. Destroy the Shadow King. Find the Shadow Key and destroy the Shadow King. Find... I don't know. Well then, let's just try to come back over to this area then. Because we still technically have some ex unexplored stuff. And it might be possible. I don't know. Like there was this gate. How do we end up in this situation in the first place? Overclocked. Did you destroy the key? Oh well, it's gone now. We better hope we don't need it. <laughs> yeah, that's what the idea was, really. It's to buy a whole bunch of those horses and then just teleport to one of the houses and then stack and hope that one of the horses sort of jankily ends up on the bottom. But it's kind of pointless now because the Shadow Key doesn't even exist. It's gone now. You don't necessarily need to retrieve the horse, but there might be a way to have the horse drop the item on the corner, bottom right corner, near the cliff tile, so you can potentially pick it up. A bit like in one of those campaign levels where you can pick up an item from Illidan. I didn't drop the key. I overclocked it. Right. So we need... Can't you just block yourself in here, maybe? With millions of houses? Although that's unbuildable terrain. There he is. That's not him. That's just one of the guys. I need it once again. We will share our ways. It's such a shame there's no item that allows you to mirror image or something like that. If it must be done. I will do my task. I need it once again. If it must be done. I'll do my best. I need it once again. I will do my task. There he is. The King of Shadow can see in Viz. So he's here. I mean, what are you even trying to teleport in there for? There's no Shadow Key anymore. Can I please use Fod over the wall by dragging the king when Harpy's to it? 
Finger of Death over the wall by dragging the Harpies. Maybe the Hand of the Gods can open this. What do you mean? Oh, right. Yeah, it's not going to insta-give the king, is it? Maybe. You need to get the hound to, like, here. But that looks like doodads that are going to block. And it doesn't look like you can go from that side. So I don't even know how you can get in there. What? I didn't even finger a death much, did it? Did I finger a death myself somehow? Stack your units on top of you and try to glitch yourself through the gate with Windwalk. I don't know, that happens. Just stay in the corner. All right. So when it ends, like now, or just literally wait for it to complete the end. Removes blight. Right, what I suggest you try is you build houses. Yeah. Like you you have one gap at the corner here. Give me that item. Don't use this house, you filthy casuals. I go buy some more houses. Overclocked. Go to the fountain so I can steal from you indefinitely. Let's just drop that and that. Just drop all of this stuff. TP's on me. Oh, the mercs are trying to get there. Some of them got there. Yeah, my castles aren't really that close though, are they? No, that's true. Oh shit, yeah, I still need to do loads of steel in there. You can't steal from myself. <laughs> To make sure the closest pathfinding spot to you is behind the gate. Everything around and on top must be blocked by units or buildings. So what I was thinking is you build a house here, you build a house here, you build a house here. I mean, if you could go crazy, just houses all over the place. But otherwise, you units in this bit. And then you have this one spot here that you TP into. And then you build a house there. And it's got to port you out, hasn't it? So maybe it ports you across... Or it just ports you back to the left. They won't let me in because I'm a thief. It's 
trying to break my fingers. Do you actually lose any money from this overclock? It's amazing how such a short time I'm doing this for and my fingers feel specifically my left one really, not my index finger. Feels like completely crippled. I swapped from my pinky to that one. I could try my middle mouse, my middle finger and index. It's a bit slower. Gone back to the uh, wedding ring finger. Alright, I think 22,000 should probably tide me over. Let's just get the horses on cooldown, more or less. I can actually TP them across to places, can't I? Which is handy. Yeah, the terrain is going to block us. But we can put the houses there, which is important. Okay, let me just drop these for now. Think about the other ones. Put the units on the terrain spots. Yeah, it's a good idea. Hmm, it's kind of weird how it's porting everything so far to the left. Not even like here. Now what? Delicious. Is that all? Now stack them up in the corner with your wind walking. I wouldn't use a summon, to be fair. I'd rather have a permanent unit be sitting there. And I want everything to fit in as tightly as it can do. Probably better just to do a horses only, because they've got the same model. Who 
would you want to kill? They take up like the same amount of space, sort of thing. we're in. Well, at least I ported there that time. You have to move overclocked. Even if I get on the other side, will I be able to solo the boss? UTP, what? All your units will move. We have so many of these items. Just need one of the horses to get in there, really. So put a horse, at least have one of these horses. See if she's got any more tiny houses, really. Don't really want to TP from there. Yes, well done. 389. That's a good waste of a house that I'm going, waiting to try to buy some more. Wind walk and break, wind walk. No, that ain't going to port you through, though. Items. Job's done. Problem Job's is, if done. I pour, it's going to move those horses, isn't it? Oh, I don't know. At this point, Inventory is full. I don't even know. So, drop tiny house here. Take this. We don't need the tiny castle. I actually can put those in the houses. They all look the bloody same, these things. You caught me. Now what? You caught me. Job's done. Cunning plan. <laughs> you again? Is that all? Do you want axe? Now what? Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Can this little guy get in there? Who'd you wanna kill? Let the little guy in. No. You got me. Yes, he can. Stop! Go. Freaking work. Right, okay, so what we need to do is we basically need to transfer each other over somehow, don't we? If not, then we just need to give me mega items or something so I can solo the boss. Either way, I'm going to drop 
tiny mansion here. Pass the item over there. That's possible to pass it over. You have to kill the houses now. But don't do that yet, because I'm just... <sighs> How do we get... If I put this item in this house, I really... I really... I'm scared. Right, hang on a second. I want to see if I can pass it along the houses. So I can... You can see this. This is witness. You can move the item. So if I put this item in here, there's a chance that I can move that and then drop it and then put it on overclocked. There you go. But you need to sort of do the similar thing where... Yeah, there you go. And people think I'm dumb. <laughs> I mean, I'm not technically smart, but I think I'm street smart. So we need to get the item. Where did you do? Oh, you put it in here, did you? So, 389, come here. You got the item now. I have no items on my character. That's the only downside. But let's hope we're strong enough anyway. Let's have a look. Let's have a little play. Just do not drop that item, no matter what. Can't I just teleport outside and teleport back in? Yeah, I can. If you give me the teleport item, actually, yeah, I can. So I'll come back in a moment. I'll try this. I don't know. Most of the items I had were over here. I can actually teleport with a whole bunch of the units as well. So we've got the mask. These aren't necessarily the best items in the world, but whatever. As long as I've got the mask of death, that's the main thing. You do not possess the key. You are not allowed in because you do not possess the key. Send everything in. The horses are the, always the first to die. Let's just put a tiny mansion here or something, isn't it? <laughs> I'll put one a bit closer to like over here. There you go, chat. That's the beauty of Warcraft 3. It has got so many mechanics, there's an, often a way to exploit them, which obviously is a lot of fun just got to think and find a way to do it, even though it seemed like it was impossible. We found a way. Find my crit item. Oh, I, it's too much of a headache to even think about where I'd drop some of these items. At this point, let's just try to get the map beaten. We've got the other two heroes here as well, so that should definitely make enough of a difference, even if my hero's not strong enough. Yeah, the mercs are nice. You gotta remember, these mercs ain't exactly that impressive at this stage compared to what we're fighting. The giant's not bad, though. The ensnare could be useful for pulling the boss back. You've been awarded a gift for the gods. I got level 25. I don't remember getting a gift from the gods. You got Majelna. Melna. Maybe. I don't know. You got Bash, though. That's bloody good. Send in the boys. I got this guy. Wait. Oh, you got the Hound of the Gods. Right, because I had that as well. Oh, Shadow King's definitely going down here. Yeah. 
in the whole season. Don't encourage the comment section. But do encourage them. So thumbs up the video, subscribe, share. Patreon.com slash witty warcraft. Twitch.tv slash witty. Staff of the gods themselves. At last, the hour is at hand. <laughs> the titans have been defeated and the great earth is safe. The ethereal order has completed its task and is no longer needed in this world, but some of you warrior spirits may linger here and yet find another purpose. Huzzah! We actually beat the map after about two hours of beating the map, technically. Teleports are here anywhere in the great earth while providing the strength and agility and armor of a god. That bash is nice, though. That's hitting me hard. But you can't fight a god! Divine armor is still going down as well. <laughs> Wait, how do you blink? Oh, that's the. Ah! Oh. Well, that would have been helpful. There you go. I feel like one of those animes where the heroes are like teleporting everywhere. Dragon Ball Z or something like that. Within like five seconds they've teleported like 600 times. Well, we can thank this lady over here. Thank you, ma'am. If it wasn't for her, we wouldn't have been able to do this. You may have the staff of the gods. You've earned it. No, I think we're done now. We overclocked. <laughs> GG. Well, like I say, if you want to help support this channel, please do consider patreon.com slash wittywarcraft or come twitch.tv slash witty and subscribe. That's the best way to help support me. Um, you can use Amazon Prime. If you've got Amazon Prime, you can connect that with your Twitch and subscribe for free each month. So that's a great way to just have like a recurring support for a streamer, especially if you're not using it. And uh, yeah, that's uh, always helpful. Otherwise, you can request any custom map you want. Well, within reason, actually, to be fair. You know, like general good custom maps. If it's something like UTD or something, it's got like a £5,000 limit. Uh, <laughs> you know, there's some custom maps that are just like, yeah. If it's going to take that long to beat or something, yeah, no. But otherwise, yeah, do consider support and it. it does help a lot. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.